The uh, vaccination has arrived. <laughs> As Greg Hunt said, the eagle has landed. <laughs> uh, yes, the vaccination is here, and we saw over the weekend, uh, first in line was a World War II survivor, and uh, she was the age of 85 and gave the reverse V sign, uh, V for vaccine, up yours. <laughs> and ScoMo was right there beside her too. you got to love that bloke, don't you? When the whole country was on, on fire, where was he? Hawaii. Hawaii. When the sports wrought scandal broke, where was he? Japan. God, he's got bad Quarantine timing. Quarantine for two weeks. Well, he's got great timing. But when there's a coronavirus jab going around, where is he? First in line. <laughs> Absolutely. ScoMo uh, was the one who famously said, bushfires? <laughs> well, I don't hold the hose, do I? But uh, <laughs> he was like... just about grabbing the syringe last night and jabbing it in. Action. He's saying, oh, no, I'm just doing it for the as the Prime Minister just to show everyone that it's safe. No, you're not. You're getting a vaccine to make sure you're okay. Actually, you're right. Okay, hello. What would have made, been better is if he had said, I was scheduled to have this vaccine, but, but he's an elderly, p- elderly person. Or a frontline worker. Yeah. Or a security guard working at a hotel. And uh, I'll stand aside while somebody else gets there. No, no, no. He almost pushed the World War II survivor <laughs> into a trolley <laughs> head first. <laughs> the he trouble said, I'll is, take two. Uh, I suppose, you know, good, good news, bad news, you know, good call, bad call. Uh, First, people who are vaccinated, at least we can see whether there's a side effect. Yes. Okay. So uh, now we're watching those people to see if there's side effects. If one of those side effects is pooping your dax at the Engadine McDonald's, <laughs> how will we know? I know, it's very, very <laughs> yeah. hard. Is that a side effect or is that just ScoMo? <laughs> anyway, well done. Got the moon man in the morning. Sydney's 104.9 Triple M.